people view fashion as like a very exclusive thing and it's only for like a certain kind of woman. But that's not true. We all wear clothes all the time and fashion can be used as a wellness tool. It makes us feel good when we look good and it doesn't have to be like these really intense crazy looks. It's just wearing stuff that makes you feel comfortable and makes you feel you. And I want to bring that to all different kinds of women. our dresses together. Kind of We're like a jungle. <laughs> Tell me about yourself, where you're from, how old you are, what you do, everything. Go. Okay, go. Go, on. go right now. Um, I'm 29 years old. I'm from Roslyn, New York, so on Long Island. I went to school for anthropology and was really focusing on kind of visual anthropology. And now I work at a store in the West Village called Kelowna Shop. I also teach yoga and an Ayurvedic educator and then work with people one-on-one -on -one to help them figure out a little bit about themselves and how to stay balanced in this kind of crazy New York world. And it's meant to use the body to quiet our mind because our mind always has something to say. And Ayurveda is a sister science to yoga because oftentimes if we're not feeling good in our mind, maybe our body reflects that or vice versa. So it helps us to stay balanced and it's based on the five elements in the world that are also within us. And so the true purpose of Ayurveda is to bring us back into the rhythm of nature because you can see these elements within nature, within these seasons. Also, as we age, we our body changes. So the more that you can get back in tune with your environment, the more your body, it knows exactly what to do. But our mind always gets in the way. So always. Ayurveda brings you back to that state where you, like the leaves, they don't, they don't think about when they when they're supposed to fall, it just kind of happens. And it's the mm -hmm. same things within our own lives. If we can just kind of tap into that rhythm of life and then also tap into the rhythm of ourselves. So interesting and so cool. How do like the seasons, because we're talking about how to dress from summer to fall, how yes. do the seasons affect your dosha? These transitions between seasons are actually super important. And then for me, as somebody who has more of an air element, I actually like the fall because it's like, okay, this is your time to ground. This is your time to like nest. This is your time to like invite in the season with a little bit more care, I feel like, than you yeah. do with summer. Because in summer, you just kind of throw things on, you go with the flow, but I almost feel like fall is like kind of a reset. If we're talking about dressing, fall, it, uh, there's a lot more thought that goes into it. Like, yeah, for sure. Like how many layers do I have to put on? Like, should I bring a jacket? Should I not bring a jacket? Should I, you know, sweater, no sweater? I feel like there's a lot more to think about. And yeah. it's also so transitional that I don't know, you might not want to buy new things. It's kind of maybe more about using what you have and layering mm -hmm. what you have and making what you have work. For sure. What I thought would be fun, yeah. and also I feel like it would works well with you and your sensibility, is as summer comes to an end and fall begins, I want to find ways to take the looks that we love from summer mm -hmm. and transition them into fall, whether it's just adding a sweater or adding colors or layering, just so we can like have the things that we feel comfortable in and we love make them work for the new season. I would like for you to show me mm -hmm. your favorite summer outfits, maybe yeah. like your top five summer outfits, mm -hmm. or top four mm -hmm. and then we will make them we'll fall adapt ready. them yes okay, cool let's go look in your closet let's go let's do it here we go here we go all right so classic and easy breezy is like a long vintage slip dress that i love super beautiful piece with like nice details wait so as a petite person you have to yeah. teach me you like long to the ground yes because it emphasizes the height of yourself mm -hmm. versus like maybe if it cuts, if it off. cuts off visually you're truncated mm -hmm. so i like to wear the kind of long pieces because it gives you the illusion of someone who's a bit taller okay i agree with yeah. that. You can also hide a hide a little sun, sun, sun yeah. in the below. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. This is exactly. beautiful. Love this. We can make this perfect for fall. Amazing. So another thing that I like to wear is this really cool wrap skirt. So I kind of like things that are a little bit architectural because it gives you like edge or emphasis. Yeah. And so this like wraps all the way around. And then I'll wear it with this cool, I don't even know how to describe it, this crop top that's like kind of like sailor-like. Yeah, I wear these two together. For like an everyday look, jeans, if I'm not feeling like wearing a skirt. These are like vintage guest jeans. I like something that's high waisted because my legs are longer than my torso. So it kind of emphasizes that. And because I am petite, I often, like you'll see all my shirts, all my pants are usually cuffed. And then I'll wear this with like a wrap top. So I'll just kind of like wear nothing underneath and just like wrap that around. Okay. 
And then my last look, which is like my true everyday look, Let's see it. <laughs> is a linen pant that is also high waisted. And I wear it with like a little crop top, super, super tiny. Okay, these are perfect. I think we can totally work with these looks. Amazing. And make them fall ready. Let's start with the slip dress. I'm gonna have you put it on and then we're gonna Go add some there. things. Okay, yeah. beautiful. Okay, awesome, let's do it. All right, let's see. Woo, I love this. This is such an easy summer look. For sure, you just throw it on and it looks like a complete outfit and feels good, nice and silky, and it has like a little slit Ooh. if I wanna like <laughs> work the dress a little, you know? I love that, and that's vintage? Yeah, it's vintage. I feel like slips you can find such good ones at For vintage sure. and thrift stores. Yeah. And I feel like people don't realize, like it's not gonna fit you perfectly, but you can mm. take it to a tailor like for yeah. really cheap. You, it's okay to like get something and sort of customize it to fit you. And for I feel sure. like that fits really good. Feels good. Yeah, to for sure to, fits, to like make it your own. Exactly, especially of. if it's something thrifted. But this fits you amazing. And you would normally in the summer just wear this with a Yeah, just with these like flat. wraps, sandals. And this is a really easy one to make fall. Cool. Cause I would sort of just put a little kitten heel, not a boot or anything, because it's yeah. not winter, but just something that is a little bit more covering. Okay, so let's, let's try these. Try. Found those in your closet. Thank you so cute. I like these little kitten heels because they elongate the foot, but they don't look like too as loud as like a proper heel. And so it's a little bit more subtle. With like your skin tone, with the black, it's amazing. And then I would maybe put on, to me feels very you. I'm, I'm already obsessed <laughs> with this jacket. I would just put this okay. jacket on over. And you're just a fall, yeah, roll the sleeves like thing? you do. <laughs> roll your sleeves. Just maybe like add a darker bag. When I'm wearing black, yeah. I like to wear a black bag with either like like texture or Beautiful. pattern, so I would do so that. I already feel like a new gal. You feel so cool. Wow. You look amazing. Even just by adding this one layer, I think it makes it so much more substantial and so much more fall. It, it feels amazing. I, I feel love like this. I don't know what I need to do, but I need to do something in you, this complete outfit. I love it. It's yeah. so great. Okay, let's just do a quick pick. Cool. I feel like this is kind of in line with your style, right? 100%, it okay. feels natural. I love it, natural. perfect. Okay, let's do the next look. Cool, thank you. Right? This is very, very bright, summery, light. I love it. it. Feels good with like this scarf. It gives it like a nice texture. Ooh. So what I would do is I would maybe add a sweater. It already feels really nice. Okay. Love that. And I would do like a jacket over. It feels really cool. That feels really cool. And then maybe like a sneaker or like a brown boot. Totally. And let me see what bag. Maybe something like this with a little, it's like a little black or even something with color. Yeah. This color is amazing. Yeah, that's a, that's a really good color. I like that. And then I like the lightness and the, the texture of the linen with this. I yeah. think like mixing all of these luxe textures is really important and interesting, especially if you're being like a little bit more tonal in terms mm -hmm. of color. To mix the texture gives the look depth. For sure. So yeah, I would do this with like a brown boot or um, one of your sneakers. I'm not gonna make you put it on, but <laughs> okay. I think this looks super cute. And you can even, if you want, you do already have the hood, Yeah. but you can also add, add your scarf. And this, is, this feels this feels amazing. I feel like I should be going to the airport. Right, and like it's like a sh very chic. Europe, yes, somewhere. very chic um, travel look. Yeah, I love it. Let's do a picture of this. Amazing. Stand right here. And then, for example, like if you are not like a linen pant wearer, yeah. I would do this, for example, like with a white denim. Mm -hmm. And I think it's just more about like the layering and the texture. So it's like maybe like a white denim, a lighter color sweater, and then like a lighter color jacket. Yeah. And the pop of color with the bag. On the go. Okay, I love this. Cool. Let's Thank do another you. one. <gasps> Fun! <laughs> I like this. I love this look. I love this little top because it makes everything else look like nice and long below. Yeah. Again, the texture is yeah, like perfect for, sure. for summer and fall. I would maybe try this. Let's see yeah. what this looks like. Cool. This is really, really cute. And I would do this with like a higher boot, like a white bag or something like that. This is cute, is this vintage? Mm -hmm. This is like a different look for you, but I enjoy it. And I like, so again, we're mixing patterns, but I find that that is totally doable and looks good when it's tonal. So this is blue and white and this is white and blue. Yeah. So it like, they kind of speak to each other. It feels good, it feels natural. What I like about the fall is like when you do like a daytime activity where you like kind of go outside and you're almost dressing for the day. And this feels like a nice outfit that you can kind of just wear, it transition from day to 
tonight and feel good. Yeah. And you have like lots of layers. You like add a nice little sunglasses and you feel kind of chic. Yeah. For your like weekend activity. Overcoat of some kind mm. potentially. Maybe like a denim jacket could be cute. Or even like, let's just see what this looks like on, just because it's something totally different. Might work, it might not. That's how we learn. That's how we learn. We try. Oh, that looks pretty cute actually. Yeah. Wow. Right? It's crazy. <laughs> do you it's, like it? I do. It's like very sharp, it's very put together. And like you were saying about um, Ayurveda being all about balance, yeah, when you're sure. dressing it's also all about balance. I find that's really important when you're dressing as well, just to like, yeah. if you're gonna have one element be super colorful, then like the other things should be toned down. If you want something to be really soft, then the other thing should be a little bit more structured. Yeah. And I think that this is a good structure to balance that soft. Okay, let's do the next one, okay. which is just the simple jeans, den jeans. perfect. <laughs> Jeans and a shirt. This one will be easy breezy. Easy breezy. Here we are. That is so cute. I love this look. It's a perfect summer. Honestly, works for fall too. You're making my job too easy. <laughs> what shoe would you normally wear? Just I would wear the, these with Converse. So this is kind of like a going out for drinks. Don't want to get like too dressed up. Want to kind of be casual, but this is simple and kind of textural also. Yeah. But maybe to sort of dress it up yes. a little bit. This is a very like simple look, but Love. I think this is great. This blazer. And I picked out this length for you because I wanted something oversized, but I know yeah. a lot of petite women don't love when anything's too boxy because it's a bit yeah. overpowering, but I thought this was slim but still long and totally. I think that that gives the same effect as like an oversized blazer just Completely like a, agree. the longer length I would do these my favorite shoes of yours yeah this is perfect love it perfect. I would do maybe a bag like this yeah I love that that's really cute or even just like again the simple yeah for black sure. I feel like we took the look from being like a bit more summery and airy yeah. by adding the black elements kind of grounding it and making it more appropriate for fall yeah I love this. Would you wear this look? 100%. And also, like, gives it a little bit of structure. And so this feels like it kind of gives it a little bit more depth and it feels sturdier also. I love that. I just wanted to try on one other thing because yeah. I thought this would be really cute. For sure. Like a, like a silky skirt mm -hmm. I think could be super cute yeah. with this too instead of the jeans. I agree. Okay, let's try that. Let's try. Let's do a me, photo. D, me, right? Yeah, D, we get in the should photo. I, should I like get down below? Yeah, <laughs> get with him in the picture. <laughs> D, me. Oh, you guys coordinate well, black wow, and white. Wow, come he, on. He loves the white accent. I'm sorry, this is like the best <laughs> picture ever. <laughs> cute. What do you think? I think that's very cute. And I think that this is something that a lot of women have bought for the summer. For sure. So I think this is something that we can really, really easily work for fall. I would maybe add this little like Madewell cardigan, again, cropped, which I think works on you. For me, fall is about layering and like yeah. the texture. So then I would put this I'm blazer excited over. excited about that. Yeah. Cute, and then I would button this. I like that. I'm all about putting buttons under buttons or like having like a denim shirt and putting it under a blazer, for just you. the layering aspect. I would do it maybe with like a black boot or even like on a warmer day, a sneaker. I think this looks super, super, super cute. Do you want to look at it? Sure. Yeah. Wow. Cute, right? Definitely. And maybe even like, I don't know if the blazer makes it a bit businessy. Yeah. So we can instead something like this to sort of dress it down a yeah, little. Yeah, that feels right. Yeah, that looks cute. And I picked this for you because I thought it would be nice to like make a little waist or even yeah. just like by cinching at the waist. I think that's sort of an elongating. Okay, let's do a photo of this one. Cool. Cute. Thank you. Love that. I love floral like maxi dresses like yeah, this. Well, yeah. I mean, I find when it has a dark background, like mm. navy blue, black, dark green, yeah. it is more fall-like. So For I could sure. see wearing this now mm -hmm. with flat shoes or just wearing this with like a boot and like this jacket Gorgeous. for when it gets cooler. I'm somebody that when I buy something, I want to wear it right away. So I think that's perfect. If you buy something like this now, you can still wear it, but then it also, it has longevity. You can save it and wear it also for fall. Yeah. I love that. I love this piece. Okay. So I just kind of wanted do a quick yeah. summary of what we did today these like your pieces are all one of a kind so like people watching mm, might not have the exact same totally. thing but it's sort of like a formula yeah so for example if you have like a slip dress or just like a favorite silky summer dress yeah. add a jacket okay. your favorite jacket something with I don't know either like a fall color or fall texture suede is great and I think the oversize worked well with the the long slip 100%. and like the stuff like we said the balance the mm. so 
softness of the silk with then like the harder suede, yeah. I think made a really great look. The next was the linen pants, mm -hmm. which we put with a sweater and then sort of a cashmere like coat robe. Dream come true. Ugh. There's nothing right? right to love about this. It's so fresh. Then we had our favorite skirt. We did this with just like a striped sweater or like any sweater would be cute. If you have just like a you know, a favorite piece, yeah. a favorite skirt or dress or pair of pants that you wear in the summer. First things first, try throwing a sweater over it and see yeah. how that works. It always looks good. So this, and then we added this, which was again about the balance, the, yes. the toughness and like the sweetness. Mm, totally. Gives it an edge. Exactly. And then lastly, just like the classic button up or white shirt with jeans. Mm -hmm. And we just added a blazer. It made everything different. Amazing. It really transformed the look. And then the silky slip skirt mm -hmm. with the sweater yeah. and then this beautiful green jacket beautiful. over. How do you feel? I feel so good. I feel like you took such care and attention into like every piece and really made it accessible. Like some of these things I kind of do intuitively, but I don't really know why. And you helped me to understand kind of like the science behind how to dress for a petite girl. So I'm super grateful. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Super beautiful. This is so nice. Oh my gosh, my pleasure. You and Dewey. Come on! Yeah.